you're a racist. What? What? You don't like me because you think that I am an Arab. What? No. What are you talking about? Excuse like me. That. Wait. That oh, wait, boy. I, I... I am his mentor. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James De Santa. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on um, uh, Hampstead uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Huh? Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? Gotcha. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? So, Mr. Kenneth, were we at uh, financing? Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dawg. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simeon? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. Attack me? Simeon, I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Huh? Now look around. Just keep, Just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. It was a repo job. Got Right, behind on his fucking note. Unlikely. Consider my son just got the car. 
And looking at the way you're going about this, my, my finger's on the trigger, dipshit. My guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked the fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dawg, by the name of Simeon Yateri. So this businessman, he look legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. Hey, man, it's Jess up here. Okay, stop the car. Pull up. Hey, that the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Boom. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck it. Ram it already. Samuel, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! See now, you've pissed me off. You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist! I'll tell you something. This thing's gonna need some serious body work before it's worth five grand a month. Ah, he agreed to violencing I have his signature. Yeah, did he agree to have some funk break into my fucking house? I, I don't know. I, uh... That kid might be a fucking idiot. But you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Oh. Don't make me have to come back here.
<laughs> okay, no, you're fine. It looks wonderful. I promise. Look, stop stretching out. Is it me? Yes, now get out of here. Next time you have to tell me what happened underneath the boardroom table. Okay, I'll get my assistant to uh, book a blow dry next week. We'll see you soon. Welcome. I'm going to make you gorgeous. Let's do this. Looking good. I love making people totes amaze. See you around. What do you want? 
Man, I come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. <laughs> okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years. And I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately. And maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. Go to college. Then you can rip people off and get paid for it. Capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, and today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? Nothing. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> Yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. It's not too far from here. Let's go. All right, man. I'm following you. <sighs> Let's take Amanda's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink with... Dad, shit! I'm in our boat going down the Western Highway. It's... it's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane. All right, I'm coming for my boat. All righty, then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. I'll do what I can to help with that, man. I just restored this. Lesson number one. Don't ever have kids. Hey, man, look, if I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had boat privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? No, oh, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Mythologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Really? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper-wearing motherfucker? Because I can still teach you a thing or two. My boat! Yo, boat's in a fucking hurry, man. Yeah, well, we'll catch him. Don't start shooting without my say so, man. I need to get my fucking head down. I know when to shoot a fucking gun, kid. Oh, shit! They fucking trapped the engine! Fuck! 
Back here, dog. You drive us there, we can get the ride fixed. My boat. It's just a thing. My boat. Please stop doing that. Listen, I, I fucked up, okay? I I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give a shit about is this fucking boat. No. Not that, it's... All we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or, it's not, but it's partly your fault. I... I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, would you do me a favor and give this kid a ride home after they fix this thing? I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great! Leave me with the home invader! Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name How. He gonna look after him. All right, take what's in my pocket. A couple thousand bucks. That'll cover it, right? So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. All right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man. They dropped it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You go and get your head right, all right? All right, listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? So, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man, let's trick this whip, homie. Good as new. Take it easy. All right, man, I'm taking you home. It's Franklin, right? Yeah, Franklin. Or the credit for our guy. The home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah, I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Jimmy, ain't it? Or James? Jimmy. Or just like... Jizzle? <laughs> no, nah, man, I'll just stick with Jimmy, homie. So, uh, what's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership. Like, someone steals my whip. And Papa's all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. 
Your pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. <sighs> man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separately. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. <sighs> yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. Tough. I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. Not fired as such. I, I didn't get a job. I been there, homie. Huh? You been putting resumes out there, but no one's hiring, huh? No, I, uh, I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. It feels like hard work. Life, the days just kind of disappear. Hey, you play right to slaughter? Nah, not since the first couple. Okay. Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just like, shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on? Strip clubs? Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit, I need it, man, but, uh, hey, hey, you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. all right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean, I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace. Hey, look, man. Look! You were like a son to me. Employee of the month. Does that mean nothing to you? Man, the dude had a gun in my head. No loyalty, no integrity. You should have taken the bullet. My business, my totally legitimate business. You are fucked, my boy. Fucked. It's fine. Yep. Come back anytime.
I say that po' boy's lying. But you know what? It's getting to be a bit much. I have no idea how you cope. Of course I cope. I'm a woman. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? <laughs> <laughs> but girl, I done done all that I can do. But you know how boys are. Wait a minute. Oh, girl. Whew. Hey, how much further? We ain't even gone five yards yet. Okay. I know, I'm just asking. This is spirit walking, exercises body and soul. It's all the rage. We are women we and are we women. are free. Free and patriarchy. We, we, we are women. Here are we are free. We are women. Here are shouting. We are women. We are women. We are women. We are women. Damn. F, is that your auntie? Yeah, thank God I missed her crazy ass. She's spirit walking this shit now, man. That's just her attempts to... Hey, hey, don't be talking shit about your auntie, man. She got it. I mean, she cool as a motherfucker, man. Come on. Come with. We gotta go pick up some shit from around the corner, man. We can walk and talk at the same time, my nigga. Why the fuck we can't drive? Around the block with Chop? You need to walk with your fat ass. <sighs> yeah, okay, you tall, linky son of a bitch. Come on, homie, we ain't got all day. Let's go. For sure, but what you got up? Kidnapping fool, that clown D, that OG <laughs> fool from Ballers. Right. Dog, I told you, no more game banging retro vengeance bullshit. I'm trying to make some fucking paper. You gonna make some paper, low? And ain't nobody out here gang banging. It just look like that. You gotta know the difference, man. Fuck, oh, man, great. My aunt would be very happy, homie. She wants me dead anyway, so she can get the fucking house. You driving. Get in the van, Chop. Get in the van. Good dog. We going to Vinewood Boulevard. Hey, I like your dog, homie. Me and Chop got a lot in common. Your annoying ass. Man, I'm carrying both of y'all asses, homie. Look what I set up. Man, fuck this, man. You seen Tanisha? She's straight. It's me and you that ain't straight, though, homie. Dog, I know, homie. But look, I met this contact, this white dude. Real serious dude, man. This motherfucker know the streets, homie. I know he'll be a good hookup for us. We don't need no hookup, fool. I know these streets. You know these streets. Man, all you know is dime bag hustling, credit card stealing, boosting gas tankers on me. Come on, man. You trying to be some fucking commodity trader or something? Fool, that shit went up, man. Look, homie, I don't mind dying, you feel me? But I just want to die for something that matters, homie. That's what foreign gangsters should really be about. And I know this much, the motherfucking OGs ain't even giving a fuck about us, though. Man, fuck the OGs, then. You know what I'm saying? This ain't no motherfucking pyramid scheme. No, wait, hold on. Listen to your boy one time. Listen to your boy. You want some paper, my nigga? This is what it's about. Check it out. I'm talking about 40,000. No problem. Cash in hand, two days' time, no killing, nothing. No, just starting another beef with the fucking ballers, nigga. That's class A felony bullshit. We gonna keep our disguise on. Ain't nobody gotta know it was us. Yeah, whatever, homie. We'll see about that. Hey, I know you dry that emperor. So why are we in this bucket? It's struggling on the incline. I don't care about no hills. I can get guns, dogs, snatched up fools, you name it in the back of this motherfucker. Glad to see you got your priorities straight. He down his alley up here. Hey, what's up, boo? Ain't you little Laida's cousin? Yeah. Damn, you short witty. I was just saying, I was trying to and holler at you. You ain't hollering at nothing over here. Why has it gotta be like that? I'm an OG. An OG? So what? So the fuck what, nigga? It's a million OGs. Well, over shit, here. how about I put one of these little X pills up your ass crack? Next thing you know, you're gonna be begging for it, little That's disgusting. What's happening now, D man? Ain't no fun if the gangsters can't have none. Man, fuck you, Mark. I ain't sharing no ass with the CGS. Ain't nobody sharing nothing. Man, shut the hell up, fuck bitch. Fuck you, nigga. Man, fuck y'all. Hey, ain't there a law against you, Mark Ass, gangsters, insignia, mask wearing motherfuckers? Oh, so what's up now, nigga? You snitching or something? Oh, oh shit! Ass nigga. Fuck you, nigga. I'm out of here. Fuck y'all, man. Get that nigga. Come on, let's go. In a van, we gotta go. He on a bike, man. We ain't gonna catch him. Oh, gangster, we got this. 
It's gonna get bumpy, Chop. You seen that bitch back there? She a dime. I'm all over that. And she probably the same. Like I said, they flock. Flock your mind on this shit right here for a minute. You worse than Chop. Back up! Do that weird, like, focus shit you do. Ain't no stopping us on this hill. Fuck it. I should have took the wheel. Like you could have done better. This piece of shit ain't going no faster. Motherfucker jumping left. Don't overshoot that shit. Bitches! Man, look at this shit, dawg. We chasing another motherfucker on a motorcycle. If we snatching this dude, we snatching his ass right. Remember the homies around the block? Man, the homies is lame. Yeah, so we not. Cops on their cell phone as soon as they made the ransom call. Triangulated the signal. Ghetto birds all over the place. Surveillance, my nigga. Oh, shit. Damn. He got fucked up. Man, take chop. Go get that fool. Nigga, you just sit in your ass there with your feet kicked up. Come on, chop. Come on. Go bite his ass. Get that motherfucker, chop. Get him! Hey, I don't want to watch you getting eaten by this canine, punk! Huh? I'm gonna give you a big bone when you catch this asshole. <laughs> You won't pay for this! Whoa. Where you going? This like sprint train. Get him, boy! to do. <laughs> Shit. Get out that thing, Chop, you filthy motherfucker. This ain't time for humping, Chop. Come on, man. Come on, you horny little motherfucker. You need boot camp or some shit. Go, boy, where that OG at? Sniff him out. Scared of dogs, nigga? Oh, shit! Fuck you and your stupid dog! Don't hump him! Bite his ass, Chop! Get his ass! Get up! Oh, fuck you, you son of a bitch! That bitch just fucking bit me, man! Shut the fuck up! Hey, man, get over here! Oh, shit! 
What the fuck, man? I ain't got no beef with the CGF. Just maybe we doing our own thing. What the fuck, man? What the man? fuck in the fan, punk? Shit. Hey, Lamar Davis, is that you, nigga? Nigga, shut the fuck up. Just get in. Yeah, that's you, nigga. Fucking oh, idiot. Shit. I said Come I on. had no beef, man. Shut the fuck hey, up. Hey, man, what the Watch fuck? You, get this fucking dog Come away from me. Come on. Fuck. Hey, if you don't train Chop, he gonna be a lost cause like you, dawg. We gonna stash this dude at my spot. We going back to your crib? I've been there when you was in diapers. Shut up, man. You ain't recognize me. I knew it was you before you took that flag off. You always been dumb, Lamar. Really? Well, I guess that means we gonna have to shoot your ass when we pick up our 40 stacks. You ain't gonna pick up shit. Fans gonna be on you before you can even move, nigga. Be quiet, I gotta make a call. We got your boy. You calling them on a cell phone, you dumb motherfucker? They gonna trace this shit in a second. We want 40,000. Just pay me or pay the funeral director, motherfucker. What the fuck you done done? You just gave them our location. Now we gotta let this motherfucker out of here. Get the fuck out of here. And nigga, give me that damn phone. What the fuck? Fuck you! I'll be seeing y'all soon! The only reason you've been seeing shit cause we went easy on your ass. Remember that, dawg? The OGs go here, fuck it! This some bullshit. Take me down the cut. Man, what the fuck is wrong with you, nigga? I was getting us paid. What the fuck is wrong with you, nigga? That was a good phone. All right, motherfucker. You the motherfucker. You better watch out for them ballers. They gonna be on you now. Them cops gonna be on your ass, too. Yeah, I ain't worried about it. I'm a motherfucking gangster. You know how I do. I can take care of my sizzle. No, the fuck you kids ain't. You got to make all that racket. Everything hurts.
Man, Tracy, yo, Amanda, Amanda, you better not be not in my house. Fuck you, Michael. Go away! I'm paying that turd 150 bucks an hour to fuck my wife in my own bed? Michael, go away! Oh, no, I'm sorry, bro. She said you had an arrangement. You and I are gonna have an arrangement. I'm gonna arrange your fucking funeral. I'm really sorry, bro. I'll cop the session. I promise. You are dead, man. Oh. Fuck. Dead! Oh. Come here! Ah! Fuck. Hey, you! Stop it! What's up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked the frick in my bed. You bullshitting me. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it. I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. Just don't kill him! This truck yours? Guy's doing some work for me. He'll get it back. Might have a dead body to do it, but he'll get it back. Oh, so we killing this dude? You wish he was dead. Is that a problem? Dog shit shitting another dog's kennel. Exactly. People been shitting in my kennel for too long. Left, look, man. You get kind of wrecked, so. Hey, let's just keep on going. What the fuck is he doing? Hey, get out of the way! Motherfucker! Fuck, man, I think we lost his ass. He lives somewhere up in the canyon. We'll find him. You see that little piece of shit? Okay, this is the turn. Hey! You don't want to fucking house? Hey, keep your eye out. You left this car. Check it out. Little bricks up there. Look. Oh, shit. Cole's doing all right for himself. Hey, asshole! You ran off before we could settle our debt. Michael, fine. You got the wrong idea, man. Banging married women's a hobby, not a fucking profession. There's a winch in the back of the truck. Tied a cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I told you I comped the session, bud! Well, there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud! I'm thinking you were working on more than just her backhand! Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's gotta get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand! On your face! Oh. Bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud. We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. Yeah. My bad. Seriously. Oh, how fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! Dude! And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit! Oh, hey! Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal! Whoa! Fuck! Here we go! Ha <laughs> ha! Let's see what happens! Dude, you are probably crazy! <laughs> oh, shit! You see this shit, dog? Man, fucking drop it! Man, homie ain't coming outside tonight, dawg. Yeah, he gon' feel this one, dawg. Are you fucking serious, nigga? Ah! Fuck 
Fucking A. Let's see how he liked that. Whoa, man. Fuck. Fuck him. And yeah, fuck his deck. Hey, homie. I think you put a little more than a deck down. Yeah, it's a foolish man who fills his house on sand, baby. Hey, man, I don't think my boy Matthew was thinking truck when he wrote that shit. Mr. DeSanta, what the hell? That's not my house! Bullshit. Oh, bro, I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls for a living. I was just hiding there. Give me a phone! You! You are dead one! Green light! Green light! Martin Madrazo give you green light! Oh, I'm scared, lady. Just fucking terrified. <laughs> Hey man, that's a mean looking motherfucking essays right behind you. You kidding me? Get, can you do something? I'll give it a go, man. Keep trying. Shit, man. Get rid of him. Fuck, man. These assholes are mean. Can you see them? Are they still back there? Push the pedal, man. We gotta move. How much distance we got between us? Hey, let's go. Let's leave them behind. Alright, we managed to lose them? We got a book, man. Push the panel, man. We gotta move. Where are we on this? Hey, let's go. Let's leave them behind. Can you see them? Are they still back there? If these are Mark Madrasso's boys, there's a lot more where they came from. Fuck that dude. I will kill you, assholes! Mr. DeSanta, what the hell? That's not my house! Bullshit. Oh, bro, I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls for a living. I was just hiding there. Give me a phone. You! You're a dead one! Green light! Green light! Martin Madrazo, give you green light! Oh, I'm scared, lady. Just fucking terrified. <laughs> Green light! Green light! Mat Madrazo! Fuck you! Whoa! Home! Martin? Martin Madrazo? That's what she said. Damn, hey, dude's a kingpin, homie. And you better hope. I ain't hoping anything. Chick was a stir. Chill out. That coach should be doing the... Doing the Russian broad. Chick needs to chill the fuck out. <laughs> Dead man. Get me in! <laughs> Get me in! Shit! He got some heavies on us, homie! Oh, that was quick! Alright, help me deal with this! I'll give it a go, man! Keep trying! Come on, kid! You get kind of reckless, homie! You got a hook, man! Go! Alright, alright! Push the pedal, man. We gotta move. All right, we managed to lose them. Hey, let's go. Let's leave them behind. How much distance we got between us? We got a book, man. Go. Can you see them? Are they still back there? Push the pedal, man. We gotta move. Hey, let's go. Let's leave them behind. We got a book, man. Go.
I think we lost him. Okay, we go back to my house to think about this. Wow, shit. You did good. I mean, your aim's all over the place, but you were a help. Ah, uh, thanks. I guess. Hey, don't get defensive. Go to a shooting range, work on your aim. You'll do fine. Oh, fuck, man. Shit, you good? Fine as wine. Got a few knocks. You okay? I mean, you did good, kid. Man, I'm cool, man. I mean, you. Mentally. Mentally? Oh, man. I'm fucking excellent. My heart ain't pumped like that in years. Oh, yes! Fucking A, Bubba! Man, you sound kind of manny. You just been greenlit by the Mexican underworld ambassador to Los Santos. Trust me. We handled it. Whoever the fuck Martin Madrazo is, I've known worse. We just handled a few low-ranking clams. We sit on it, we see what happens. Kid, there's no use second-guessing. Felt good, man. Woo! Yeah, doing something for a change. Ha! <laughs> man, you know what? You are wasted sitting by that fucking oh. pool, man. You're right. Oh. I need to do something. Scotch and sunshine is sitting on my ass. Fuck that, I'm better than that. Damn Skippy, homie. All that knowledge up there is withering and dying, dawg. You don't pass that shit on, it's gone, homie. I bet you know some shit. You wouldn't believe the shit I know. Yeah? You taking some scores? There was a time, that was all I did. Shit, well, you know, I could tell you some shit, too. Yeah, like what? About this city I was born and raised in. Now think about it. Yeah, do that, man. This could be cool. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside? Sure has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh shit, I think we're about to find out. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. No, you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Franklin. License. Now, Franklin, maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now maybe give him a little of a background. Man, Mr. Madrazo... It... Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up missing. Smart kid. Now, Michael, I've got a question for you. What did you pull an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> I wasn't thinking straight. Mm, clearly. Yeah. <sighs> well, Natalia will <sighs> need a hotel while you finance the rebuilds, won't she? 
Sure. Good. And I'm guessing here that uh, the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range? <laughs> of course. Great. That's nice. Come on, man. Damn, you all right? Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Oh man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I'm gonna have to track him down. Just give me a little alone time, all right? All right, though. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker. are more expensive, but I'm always happy to accommodate. Sure, you'll accommodate me as long as I got money in my pocket, right? Hey, I'm in a bad way, Doc. I might come by soon. Fuck you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. 
I know that. And you're gonna make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean, I need something done, you need to know something, so why not help each other? I gotta make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone. That instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah. Yeah, well, <laughs> since you put it like that... Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. That little college boy sack of shit phony fuck. Who? Jay Norris? Yes. That fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails. He's a fucking cheat. I heard him say that he saved America. What, by, by outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. What the hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white-collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45-year-old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag, and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism. And brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. I'll find something. Just like the old days.
Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Huh? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? All right. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Goodbye. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you look the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. I bet you got a Hey. Hey. Oh, great. Ugh, PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's... Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke breaks about up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I... I T-temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Ah, uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. I'm turning consultant when we release. Consulting consulters. Hi. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. 
Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. Really? The brief was for a relaxed, creative individual, the kind that preferred a beanbag over a real chair, but if you're so... Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. Your son codes? Start them early, bro. You write your best stuff in your tweens. Okay, we got some space. I'll try to boot up this antivirus. Scanning. Might I tempt you with some organic chow or a fair trade java? And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. You should be mean, dude. Dude, when it blue screens again, you're my guy. Bye. Sit, 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 sit. Foot bang, dig fast. Oh. Ow! Come on, you're gonna have to learn the foot bag if you want to get a job here, okay? Follow me. Okay. Oh. How's your air guitar? Oh, um... Some a-hole drank my effing hemp milk! There was a totally non-passive-aggressive note on it! If I drown in mucus, it's your fault, you illiterate effing C's! Lester, the thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry, the phone is rigged. And what's your problem, you don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me, I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes. None of which interest me. Hey. I believe this country can still make interesting movies. There's no better way to define American life than a two-hour plot in which the hero looks good and defeats evil. Now, whatever you say, enjoy yesterday. Anyway, just call the device after he's unveiled it, and then we'll talk. guy in America. You all disgust me! America. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Mr. Jay Norris to the stage! Hey. This company has come a long way since we started it. 
in my parents' pool house in East Carraway. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination. We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years? That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary! Today, right here, we are about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay docked. Oh, hold on a second. I think someone's trying to dock with me. Hello? Oh! Get security! Ah. Oh, Jesus! Whoa! No, 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 Let's... no, 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 Whoa! Lest, that was heavy. Are you watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look.